As you can see from the last video, I have installed guiding rails, four guiding rails here. At the end of uh, every rail there is a um, free screw. So PCB board is held on these screws. What should we do next? Because our soldering station is not very intelligent and it has no programmable temperature controllers. We have only manual control and as you know every chip uh, has some kind of conditions that uh, should be met to if you want to have quality soldered chip these conditions are written by developers and uh, there is said how much time and what temperature we should apply at this chip to make everything fine so these conditions are called BGA thermal profile it's obvious that uh, for lead free soldering and uh, lead soldering these temperatures and uh, these thermal profiles are different so to ensure ourselves from destroying real chips we should train a bit on the dead ones we will uh, make some experiments uh, after what uh, I will mark some temperatures here near these demons with the help of these marks and uh, timer I will try to simulate manually that uh, thermal profiles conditions also i want to test this kind of tool it's a vacuum pen its, it's quality is very bad as you see it's only a single glue drop there that is holding uh, rubber together with this plastic so chinese style Seems that that small chip had uh, lead balls, and somewhere in the service, someone had tried to put it on lead balls because it's unsoldered, unsoldered on 190 degrees, and the bigger ones is not. 